in schoolers in, in Poland. One very interesting scholar is Krzysztof Irczykowski, who already in the in 1920s in his book, The Tenth Muse, De Setia Musia, wrote uh, about animation as, an, as being a superior medium to live action. He wrote, I quoted him here, he wrote that uh, uh, a live action uh, documentary, uh, live action with, uh, with actors and with, without actors is just a part of animation, not the opposite. And uh, eight, 80 years uh, after that, uh, Jerzy uh, Kucza, Piotr Dumala, Zbigniew Rybczynski, and many others created the golden age of Polish animation. What is the, there are several distinguished traits in illustration, caricature. Uh, it's, it's, uh, and the Polish uh, artists always managed to keep their own original visions and strong expressiveness. Uh, they, oh, oh, they have strong ability to transfer messages in original, original manner. One another uh, uh, point is concerned with uh, the way of storytelling in poly Polish animation. It's uh, Polish animators are very kind of using uh, visual aphorism, intelligent visual aphor aphorism that uh, trans transform uh, the I idea into, into something visible and understandable. Uh, another another uh, uh, interesting thing, another way of, of stylization and storytelling in, uh, in Polish animation is, uh, the, uh, is also a propensity toward the black humor. The, 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 you, you, you laugh very often to, to the, when, you, when you see Polish animated films, but it is the laughter, laughter uh, that uh, gave you cramps in the stomach because the motives of, of, of those, fi those films are mostly, uh, mostly included things like guillotine, gallows, uh, prisons, firing squads, uh, coffins, handcuffs, and uh, so on. Uh, Polish animator, probably because of the, the, the country's history, uh, like uh, satire very much, uh, they, there is also uh, some kind of tra tradition, tradition of satirical drawings, satirical, pic satirical pictures that is very strong present in, the, in uh, uh, Polish culture. And of course, it is a, a very important part of uh, uh, animation aesthetic in uh, Polish uh, cinema animation. And another, another uh, 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 aesthetic uh, distinguished uh, trait concerned, uh, that, that is uh, uh, very much present in Polish animation is uh, absurdity and uh, tendency to, to, to tell a story that can be uh, uh, described like uh, uh, abs absurdic. Uh, and uh, very much uh, uh, the, the, the most part of Polish animated film reminds you of Kafka's storytelling, of Kafka's uh, humor, of Kafka's, uh, Kafka's dramaturgy, and so on. Uh, one another ex ex expressive trait is uh, surrealism, irony, and uh, parody that you that you can uh, that you can uh, uh, face in by, by studying Polish animation. Uh, I can I can remember one of very very famous parodist, very successful parodist is Witold Gersh that uh, used to parodize uh, uh, Hollywood's jungles uh, uh, like uh, Western crime comedy and so on. Another distinguished trait is pessimism, pessimism or skepticism. Uh, uh, Polish animator didn't believe in, uh, in ideological lies. It didn't believe in the, in the, the state-sponsored optimism that was promulgated during the so-called socialism and communism, and they, they uh, defeated it by uh, telling us pessimistic stories. And, of course, there is, there is a, a, a very much a, a influence uh, coming from Polish history. This is a very, very, very interesting scene in uh, Andrzej Wajda's movie, Katyn, when uh, he, he built up a metaphor about Pol Polish history by using a bridge. You have Polish people on the bridge, one of, one of, one of them trying to escape uh, from, from uh, Germans, uh, G Germans so soldiers and one another uh, group of Polish people trying to escape from uh, Red Army soldiers, uh, Russian soldiers. Uh, they, they found them, themselves on the bridge. A very strong meta metaphor that, that, uh, that the 
tells a lot about Polish history that is, that is also present in, 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 in the best animated movies made by Polish animators. And there is a, one kind of stylization, stylization that is a very, very typical Polish. It is a, something a, called cartoon, cartoon noir. The Polish animation, uh, animator like uh, absurd, absurd and macabre films that are permeated by nightmarish atmosphere and authentic subtle humor. A cinema animation coming from Pol uh, Poland is uh, very much dark. People like all, uh, uh, the animator like all nuances of dark. Why is that, uh, Jerzy? Did you, your, your films are very, very, very darkish. Uh, 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 why is that? Uh, uh, did you did you think about it? Why is so so much black uh, in uh, and darkness in Polish Polish animation, both on the on the on the storytelling level and on the visual visualization? Uh, it is interesting because the same question gave me uh, Polish uh, politicians. <laughs> <laughs> ah, okay. Why these films, my projects are so dark? Yes, the film officers, uh, politicians. And um, I told them that I c can only make more darker. Uh, and uh, because, you know, it, is, it was uh, such a reality. It's this Polish school based on, on reality, on observation. And it was difficult to make funny films when around everything is very dark, very sad, without future, and it was like part of this reality. And the Kijowicz once was asked why so dark. Miroslav, Miroslav Kijowicz, who didn't make uh, uh, such dark movies. No, no, because yeah. it was more fun. But his answer was that in, Poli in Poland we don't have enough sound. You know, and, and because of that it's dark. <laughs> it was, you know, a funny answer. <laughs> but anyway, it is um, really was such a uh, reality. But um, you, you in my opinion, it was, you know, it is, uh, 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 if my films are dark, in my opinion, they are funny, but in different way. You know? I agree, I agree. <laughs> you, told, you told once in, in, in an interview that I, that, I, that I read many years ago that you, Considered your own movies as a kind of emotional documentaries. Mm. Can you develop it? Uh, it was my it's, it's, yes. It was uh, it was task for for. I decided when I was a young filmmaker. After second film, yeah? I didn't know what to do. What to do because I had several uh, totally different proposal for my films. Yeah? And um, as any. Um, as, as a young person, you know, is, uh, what to do. I, I decided to go one way based on observation and uh, observe reality, observe my, my feeling and, and feeling of other, other people in Poland. And when we put together every my films, I told today after screening, um, is that when we put together every my films, you will see long, one long film. The film he was ch is changing like life was changing around me. You know, it, it was it is it was my decision for that I can go this way for some years. Probably I should finish. It was a tuning instrument. It was idea that tuning instrument will finish this period, but but um, we will see what will happen. I'd like to ask you something about <coughs> your, your way of telling stories. Do you consider your movie to be a story at all? Or do you consider it to uh, be a uh, visual uh, poem or something? I'm not using story in yeah. my, my context. I'm not using, but I'm using action. Story is part in, in, of this action, in my opinion. It is my personal point of view. Uh, but there, is exist, there exists some story, but um, is, is n don't is the story is not domination? Don't yeah, I think what is what is very very specific for your way of telling or making making film is, a, is a, to, to choose a f some some fragments from reality and to put them together in order to say something that is hidden that is invisible. Uh, uh, how you choose those fragments? Um, depends on film. 
It depends because on film. I have some project, and I know that film uh, will be about something, you know. The parade is about different prob problem, reflections different. And I am choosing um, very carefully, and it sometimes takes a lot of time. I am choosing and collecting these elements from from observations, from memory, um, even some image, fragments of image, and it's the same way fragment of Santra. And I'm choosing and uh, trying to, to construct, construct to, in fact, to trying to express some, mm. uh, some um, uh, situation. I'm using situation. I'm not using object. I'm not using not using separated elements. I'm, I try to, to construct situations using soundtrack and... But tell me, tell me something about your movie, your, your movie Reflections, <coughs> that is completely different in the, in the way of storytelling. The story unfolds uh, uh, from, the, from the start to the end. There are no fragmentation. You are talking about reflection. Reflection, yes. <laughs> it is interesting. Do you, do you agree with me? Yes, it I agree. Different. I yeah. can explain you why. Hmm? Because after my first film, Return, Return received huge prize. First festival, huge prize, and then two other prizes in Australia. It was sent for three or four festivals, no, no more. Um, and, and then... Um, one prize for, uh, from, uh, from, uh, for film, um, uh, The Lift, Elevator, Elevator. And, uh, and um, Elevator was not presented for festivals, only for one festival. Uh, I was thrown from, I told this as well, for governmental studio after this film. Uh, and uh, they decided that I can continue my work after a few, few days. And, um, but I was making another films without prizes. And the film officer asked me, why not prizes? You had such a huge prize before. No, now. And I decided to tuning in uh, reflections. It is, it is my secret, but I can tell you. It is uh, publicly, publicly, <laughs> that... Uh, reflection was made specially for prizes, specially because the, uh, the, no prizes, and I made this film specially for festival. How did you know that you uh, would? Uh, you it was, would uh, I, I don't know uh, how. I, I, I never, how. You never know. Can but you? this film was sent for a few festivals, and every the time was grand prize or second prize. There are know. some young animators sitting here, so tell them how to how to get how to win prizes. So yes, it is interesting. It must be. It must be. And then what is interesting after prizes for this film. In previous films received prizes as well, and uh, it is interesting. It was a very think, important moment. I think it's much sim simpler than, than that. The, I think and it's it just, was, but it's, film was it's just really because the films are very good. <laughs> yes, I like this film. <laughs> I like this film, but but it's very simply the narration, very mm. simply, and there is anecdote. There mm. is anecdote in, in the telling, not very straight, but there is strong an anecdote, and I knew that. And I uh, really like anecdotes, you know, mainly. Really know, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, really it is few people, and when you have interesting anecdotes, they like this. You know, mm. this maybe now, not now, but maybe even now more. <laughs> uh, do you, do you, do you, do you f are you familiar with the work uh, of Giga Vertov? The yes, I, uh, I, I know. You know his uh, idea about film camera, the, 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 the meaning with film camera and the, with, with, with film is not to, 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 to film what is visible, but what is not visible. Yeah. yeah. Do you it agree is with, with him? Is it, is it your <laughs> point? Because I, I think that your, your movies, are, um, uh, that, you, that you try always to, 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 to show, to come to, 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 to uh, people's uh, what is inside in people, in in, in their memory, thoughts, uh, and and Jika uh, of course, when I was a few words before, when I was starting animation, I didn't want to be a filmmaker, animator, not. I wanted to be painter, and I was painter. So maybe I still still I am, and, and, uh, but uh, uh, I knew nothing about animation more about film, because I was watching some films, 
I knew she got Vierto from my childhood because it was shown several times. But for me it was clear, but, but not very interesting. Maybe we are using similar way of communication, you know. Because uh, really I like to, I'm showing, in, I, I'm constructing film as a signal for, for a viewer. I told today, after this as well, maybe I am repeating, that I would like that viewer can concentrate on yourself, not uh, watching my film should think about his life, his experience, and it is for me important, you know, that he should uh, recognize yourself during this projection. That darkness in, in your movies, uh, that darkness, is it, uh, uh, how, how, how come that you, start, that you started uh, Animate? What was your, your, your first experience of animation? Uh, did you, did you uh, see much of Polish movies? Did you no, see? No, 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 not. I was watching films, uh, live action, but uh, I was concentrated on painting and, and maybe literature, but, but not main string of this literature, Polish literature, but, but the, the literature based on reality. This was for me very interesting. For example, you don't know probably this, but it was uh, 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 translated um, to uh, various languages. Um, Bu Leopold Buczkowski. Mm. When I was young, for me, Leopold Buczkowski was very important. You person. studied together with Andrzej Wajda? No, 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 Andrzej Wajda studied in the same school, but the same school, yeah. 15 he's, years he's, before. He's a senior. With Borowczyk mm. to, together. Mm. And when did you when did you see uh, films made by Richard Czekala for the first time? Uh, Richard Czekala was my friend. Mm. My friend was one year older, uh, and even for his, uh, it was my script for his one film, The Sun. Mm. It was my script taken by him. You know, and we were friends. But he started make animation before me. Uh, I started three, four years later, mm. because only for uh, to check what I can do with animation, you know, for for pleasure. In fact. Did he influence you in, in, in no? In I, way? I, I don't think. I mm. don't think. Maybe maybe it is some close relation, but I don't think I was. My idea was from beginning the same. You know, I was looking for my personal. So your your your, your cinematic ideas are. Coming from from uh, your painting, uh, you work with material. Uh, yes, in painting, uh, I decided to make animation because, as I told a few days ago, the, the, I decided to make animation because movement and time was helping me to talk about the reality, and and this was maybe I didn't know how to do in uh, using painting, but uh, but uh, it was very easy to talk, for example, about the person, my friends, about this situation using time and movement. What I personally cons consider as a, as a great achievement in, in your movies is the work to harmonize uh, picture and the sound. Yesterday when you, when you, when you uh, <coughs> delivered your lecture to the students in Troll, to the animation students in Trollhetan, you told about uh, your own way to, to, to work with music and, uh, and, and animated pictures. And you told something very in in interesting, that uh, cinematic space, film, 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 filmic space for you is the space between the music and the, and the picture. Can you develop that uh, idea a little, little bit? It's, it sounds uh, like, a, like a very, very original concept. Uh, it doesn't mean everybody knows this rule that between, uh, when we are putting together, I can repeat this, putting together two shots, you can get, it is general rule, you can get, get um, different um, meanings than one or second, second shot. And when you put together um, the, the image and, and the music, music or soundtrack, you can, uh, you are, you can get Film space depends on how you are using this, and this is this situation is giving me. I was look, looking for personal language, language we, we can express my situation, not not inform, only express. And this relation is giving me several possibilities. For example, it's giving me the possibility to to talk in emotional way. 
and uh, is giving me possibility to to prepare place for viewer between in fact in my film is the place for viewer is between image and soundtrack um, soundtrack i understand is that for example i am using music sometimes as a music sometimes i'm using a, as a soundtrack and and and, if, and soundtrack i'm using some sometimes as a music sometimes as a soundtrack and it is interesting this for me it's very important that is giving me a chance to construct uh, personal language and uh, this language based on association um, uh, reflections um, and and this relation this relation but i am sometimes i'm using that um, situation okay, probably you have seen my films that that music and and image are talking the same but this process of changing that music is talking something different and only is related with image in special special way which is very important and very, not very easy but uh, not very easy for me but especially complicated for a composer and and this process uh, is very important for because you are keeping the viewer and the viewer can be concentrated on on this during the but you as a viewer probably don't think about that you are observing film not my my uh, manipulation <laughs> I, I don't want to manipulate but i would like to give you signal and you should react and you can react or not and it is problem for example when the projection is not good hmm. you are a viewer is reacting less is not concentrated i feel this very well uh, for example, yesterday I, I learned five minutes before screening that from Poland they sent my prince, but not best prince. I was very angry because I didn't know about uh, that. Not with me. I, I, I know that that concentration belonged to uh, to this projection. Is good or not? Proje projection was excellent, but prince was not very good. Mm -hmm. Tell me about how you construct your movie. Where is the where, where, where where do you find the material for your movies? I, I, I read once an uh, uh, autobiographical book written by Ingmar Bergman, and he, he wrote about his own way to find, um, to find a movie. He wrote that he, his starting point was a picture. He could, he could imagine a picture, and then he tried to, 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 to write continuation of the picture, what happened next, what, what happened before, and if he could write, and develop the picture. He he knew that he had a film. How you work with a, with a, with a finding your movie? What is the starting point? How you start to make? Uh, it is, I can explain, but in longer time because depend, it depends on film. First, I can start with very simply examples for reflections. I was waiting at tram sta station and was football match nearby and i was observing it was uh, before it was raining uh, uh, it, it was raining and i was observing this insect in the water and and when i was at home i make only notes and during 20 minutes and project was ready you know <laughs> and and now <laughs> there was problem how to start production but it was very simply you know it was very simply but sometimes it's not so simply because um, the, the, I have some the beginning is a many situation some meanings not image image is helping me you know helping image and soundtrack but uh, image and uh, and uh, music is coming by the by, by process of preparation and but uh, I first imagine some feeling, in fact, even feeling of viewer, not my. When you are, prepare, you are preparing film, you should be like two person. One is director, one is viewer. And it's distance between two persons sometimes. And, and you should be subjective, you should have subjective point of view and objective point of view. It is interesting, but I'm talking now about something that it is may, may be very complicated, but it is very simply when we are concentrated. And I'm concentrated, sometimes it's very difficult for 
for um, tuning instrument, I had, if I remember well, seven versions of films, of this film. Seven versions, really? different, different. And I didn't know which is, then I had three, and I didn't know which is better, you know. Seven, I'm talking now about storyboard. Storyboard. Oh, storyboard, yeah. storyboard. Yeah, it, yeah. No, not I seven final say. version. <laughs> but you know, storyboard is story, good. Storyboard is first screening yeah, of your yeah. film. Yeah, <laughs> and and, and uh, then I this uh, one day, I remember if it was evening, I knew who is best, uh, and I started to apply for money, uh, and and uh, but uh, was coming step by step, you know, because I was trying to make action who can express the situation, you know. And, and then in storyboard I have everything. I have music, but not music, you don't hear this music, but relation, you have relation. But this the rhythm of motorbike, I prepared myself this before talking with composer. And I was looking for such a motorbike with special sound. Uh, and I recorded myself this before, and I, uh, I was ready. I, when I started to work with composer, I proposed him storyboard uh, and, and this rhythm of motorbike as, mm -hmm. a, as, a, as, as a percussion. Mm -hmm. Good. But tell me, I, I consider your, your movie to be a strong <coughs> critic to, 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 to the former society and former social system. In in uh, in Poland, uh, uh, there are several several arguments for the, uh, such an opinion. Like uh, way you way you 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 construct your characters in the movie, they lo they looks like shadow shadows, and uh, uh, the way you create the the uh, 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 state mental state in in your movie that that uh, the feelings that that, that your your work radiates uh, out so uh, can you tell me uh, uh, something about the relation with uh, to to the social con context uh, and your movies um, I, I, I i i mean uh, above all your first movies like Povrot return i had some troubles i, I had some troubles a film officer did it, not censor. A censor did, did, accepted. You, did you intend to criticize a society? Yes. Oh, yeah. they, they told me that it is impossible to make such a films in, in, in Poland. Everything is okay. No politicians and film officers. Censors, censors don't have pro problem. Told me nothing. Only film officers. They were afraid, and they uh, told that. But on the beginning, l later on, they forgotten, and uh, I was uh, doing what I wanted. But, but they, in fact, I, I, I'm not. I can't tell that they supported me. Not, but they accepted. You know, later. But um, the, it was problem not only mine. Uh, people from live action area had much bigger problems. Uh, and, uh, animation. This area, anim animation, we had, in, in fact, we had freedom. We, can, uh, we had much more better situation than, than life action. And they don't, ac they don't accept this uh, darkness. Wait, wait, this what do you mean, we had, we had freedom? You could create whatever movie you like? Uh, yes, uh, they, sometimes they criticize us, but uh, it was... Uh, in fact, we, we, we were doing what we wanted. In right. fact, we had the situation... Because the politician didn't understand quite what... Uh, the, the, the animation was uh, like art, yeah. like painting, you know. The, the, the live action was showing everywhere, you know. Animation was for some festivals, for some special screening. And even they liked this, that they, uh, they were telling that we, we can do everything, you know. Mm -hmm. and they, is showing animation, you know. Even some. Wait, I if you if you compare the situation before in the in in the in the socialist po Poland and now in capitalist Poland, 
Now we can do what you like, you know, in pol but you can, don't have money no. for, for film. <laughs> it is a problem, different problem. Of course, it's, in Poland, the situation of film is rather stable. It's not very bad, but it's not very easy to get a good budget, budget for, for film. Not very easy. It is not... Mm -hmm. Before, we, we had a situation that you could... Uh, I was making film by film. Even sometimes, if I remember, too fast, maybe. I should be more concentrated. But, uh, but I was making... Uh, I'm not talking about some beginning. Uh, beginning, I had problems. I told today, maybe some people are here, that um, <laughs> I started. And I prepared script. And this script should be accepted by the film officer in Warsaw. It was part of Minister of Culture. And they didn't accept. And then I prepared another one. They didn't accept as well. Everything was ready. I was ready to start. And then I changed title of this first script and prepared the script in a different way. But the film was the same. Mm -hmm. And they accepted. Yeah. They accepted, and I started to work. They started to work, and then I had a problem. I was finishing film, and became some problem. But uh, they wanted to stop this film, but it was too late because film was almost ready. What was the, the 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 movie? What film? The, you, uh, you, you return, return, ah, return. The first one. Uh, return, first one. I'm talking still about first one. And then, uh, okay, but the film received a huge prize. Uh, on first festival it was such a festival in Grenoble. At that time, very important in Grenoble. Mm, this I festival don't exist anymore. Uh, and a huge prize. I, I started another one film, uh, the elevator. And I, I, I went abroad uh, for a short time, and I learned abroad that, that I am out of studio. I am thrown for a government and studio. And I, they told me that I, uh, I can't work for, for... But after a few days, they accepted me again. <laughs> I remember I came back with, with um, other people uh, and, uh, from abroad. I learned this. And um, for, we visited some festival, Mark Pivoski, some other people. Uh, and, but anyway, it, is, it was funny. But later on, I, I had possibility to, to make film by film. Hmm. Uh, but people are curious about your work, even, even uh, the film professionals. Uh, is uh, your technique it's very interesting. It's it's uh, it's uh, difficult to find uh, to find uh, to, to 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 analyze your movies, technical aspects of it. Can you tell us uh, the secret, the technical secret behind your movies? Do you do you use computers? Um, uh, now I'm using. Uh, I use. I use now for last film. Mm. Uh, but, but before uh, no. No, everything was made on 35 millimeters. Uh, using, I was using different techniques, very different. But always when I, uh, I have a ready project, it's this project is as a storyboard, not script. Story. Each film has its own technique. Yes, I am looking for very easy technique. Very easy. Always is very complicated, but uh, always I am looking for very simply way how to do, how to make faster, but it's not very easy. And because of that, I am using different techniques, but I don't like uh, you to see these techniques, especially. Because for me, important is, for me, important is situation and, 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 uh, and uh, uh, what you can get from sc screen, not what, of, what sort of technique. It, for me, it's better if you don't see my technique. I would like to to uh, to understand the technique. I I guess that you that you use optical printer uh, uh, very much in in some some of your movies. No, how you manipulate the the, the photography? Uh, I am using depends on film. On beginning, for example, uh, the circle. I was I used several like the, your movie parade, for instance. Ah, parade is different yeah. problem. Parade yeah. is. Totally complicated, but anyway, I can use. The, the, I can tell you a few examples. 
uh, read uh, the circle we, we haven't seen here. Uh, I was I used several level, you know, and several level, and everything was moving on several level and, and who shows several Forty level of, of what of of, of, of it is glass. image of okay. glasses glasses transparent yeah. glasses and cell yeah. yes for for example for tuning instrument I used several exposure the same effect in effect but several exposure on one frame for example I had even 14 16 uh, exposure on one frame not every time uh, sometimes only one sometimes two mainly two three but I remember that we had sometimes 14 exposure on one frame and now I, I used several level but put it, I am putting this level on computer together it is very easy everybody knows is how to use this but but we will see this example and I am using several level but in computer the way the work is the same before I was using several level. So you, you don't use any computer program, but you, you still use a film camera and 35 uh, I use uh, the computer program for last film, not for previous films, not for tuning instruments. Tuning instruments mo was made by camera Ma on 35 millimeters. Hmm? Traditional way. Tradition, very traditional. I, I knew everything about uh, film tape. Do you have any questions? We have to finish. No, no, no. 19 minutes. Thank you. Uh, when you do your storyboard, do you uh, already from the beginning have a strong uh, idea about the uh, sounds and the music that will? Uh, connect to all the pictures? I mean, do the pictures not only symbolize the pictures, but also the sound? So do they? I have this, I have this notes on storyboard. You can, you can see my storyboard. On beginning, I have notes about image and soundtrack from beginning. It is changing during the work, during the preparation, not, not during the, the, the shooting, or, but during the preparation, it, it is changing, you know, because I, sometimes I'm changing my mind. But uh, everything is ready when the uh, 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 storyboard is ready, you can find there everything. The rule of music, I don't hear this music very much, you know, sometimes I hear, but rule of music I know from beginning. But uh, as I told you, I am changing some sometimes and how to construct. I'm looking this, uh, for construction in, um, for, for possibility of expression. Which was a very good question. Do we have any other questions from the, the audience? Yep. Yes, uh, thank you very much. Uh, I, I uh, want to sort of... Um, uh, ask about this kind of um, the last film you said you made on the computer uh, or by digital. Um, what what was your experience? Did you, was there some kind of loss? Because we often talk about the loss of identicality when we talk about the transfer from real, from film from celluloid film to digital. Did you experience? Was it different from working with with the computer on the computer or? I wanted to make this film, we have not seen, we will see some parts. We have not seen, but uh, I wanted to make this film on film tape, but was very expensive. And um, even time was similar the same, but was much more expensive. And because of that, I decided to use computer, not uh, because of that, that uh, I knew that I can get it uh, worse an effect from the screen. But I use this computer to combine drawings, because uh, to combine the levels. Uh, but uh, partly is, uh, I use computer for making image as well, but mainly for combining the image who is shot by g digital camera, not in the film tape, only digital camera. Mm -hmm. And uh, oh, lots of problem with this, but anyway, not for short time. <laughs> you satisfied with the answer? Yes. Yeah. 
More questions? You? I thought it was interesting uh, that you talked about that you think both as a director and as a viewer. Uh, who gets priority in your movies, the director or the viewer? Uh, during the preparation, yes, yeah. during yeah. making film, right. yes, it is very interesting that I, sh I am trying always uh, to imagine uh, what in this particular moment of film, what sort of uh, feeling he has, and what sort of uh, what he, what sort of inform information he got before, uh, uh, have, um, and in which situation he is, you know, because in my opinion, each film director should know this. Because, and I am not making lots of mistakes, looking later, observing the viewers. And I can give you one example. With, have you seen a film Spring? With grass? Have you seen my films? There is growing grass, growing green. And when I finished this, I wanted to, um, to make situation that this grass is growing very slow. And I remember a moment when I was in lab, in laboratory, when was, I was finishing the film, and when person behind me asking another if this grass is growing or not. And it was a very good answer for me, because I wanted to create such a situation. You know? It was answered back. He didn't know me, and he uh, asking, you know, it is. And creation of uh, how to create situation, you know, how to create, and what sort of feeling you can expect from viewer. And because of that, you should be at the same time. Uh, the director, because director uh, know more about film, because he he know what is beginning, how, what is the end. You are not. You are is observing and know nothing about the end. More questions? If uh, you don't have questions, I have one. Oh. Yuri Norstein, uh, a Rus great Russian animator, who, whom we are going to, to, to meet here in Gothenburg in, in the future, I hope so, at least, uh, he told me uh, that uh, for him, his, his uh, movies are very realistic. He considered them to be a realistic picture of uh, his uh, life and the society because uh, they are based on dreaming. He told me, my movies are realistic as my dreams. Do you agree with him when it comes to your own work? Is I don't have dreams. You don't have dreams? I don't have dreams. I had accident, and after the accident, car accident. After this accident, I don't have dreams. <laughs> <laughs> I knew, I knew that. That's why I asked you. I wanted to. Um, but uh, I know, it's, I understand him. You yes, know, yes, you yes, know, yes. I understand him. Uh, yes, okay. Is it kind of compensation to? to yes, uh, it is like extract, uh, extract, and and uh, and, uh, but emotional extract, emotional mm. extract. You know, like b film is similar to dream. Yes. yes. You, when you see especially him, animated movies. Yes, especially yeah. animated. It's mm. like dream. I agree. Tell me about, uh, you, you, you told us that you, that you still worked basically traditionally by using your, your fingers uh, as a in instruments. And uh, uh, tell, me, uh, tell us uh, what you think about the future of, an, of the animation, considering the proliferation of, uh, of the new media and, the, and uh, 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 animation is now uh, a mass medium. Yes, animation is very popular. Yeah. It's very popular, it was, especially it for young people. I observe. In difference to the to the to the time when you started. Mm -hmm. It's much in, more popular. People like animation very much, uh, and I think that depends on. But uh, it is a large problem as well because, in my opinion, uh, industry is killing animation. Yep. It's killing animation because the industry is like they are using film as a. When you, when you say they the, are making money. When you say industry, what do you mean exactly? Uh, in the, in very popular uh, films for, for cinemas. Entertainment a, industry. Yes, yes, that as well. Hmm. But they, they, they make money, not, not film. And in my opinion, it is if 
if uh, we will fight, I'm talking about film uh, makers, uh, and uh, we'll continue this way. Anim it is, we are on the begin uh, on beginning of animation. It is, everything is, is lots of possibilities. In fact, it is a room for every person. You can take a person from street and he can make animation totally different than you. It is interesting. It is interesting. Lots of possibility. And it is future before you know, mm. animation. But how to use, how to make. So it is, the, somebody told that the 21st century, it is, uh, um, it is a century of animation. Animation, it is not only animated film. Animation, it is it's, uh, advertising, um, uh, animated posters, uh, uh, um, installations for art yeah, uh, uh, gallery, lots of um, uh, rooms. For big How about uh, about Polish animation? A recent Polish Polish animation. There are people that con uh, that talk talk about the second <coughs> golden age, like uh, they say the new animators uh, uh, remind remind them uh, to your your own generation generation from the first golden age. There is very strong group of people. Mm -hmm. It is younger generation is very talented, very um, well prepared for for work. Uh, huge group, huge group. For example, mainly women, mainly women. Interesting. When I was starting, mainly men was making. And now mainly women. For example, I had 70 students last year, and was five seven men, uh, women, and it is age of women. <laughs> this is interesting, but a very interesting group is waiting, and they, they step by step, they make this year probably seven or eight. Uh, last year, started in the debuts, and uh, in Krakow we have 30, 40 people, very well prepared, uh, and they can start any time in the film, and and it is very strong group. Can we see the movie now? So we Which have a couple, couple of minutes of the, uh, your, uh -huh. your movie, you are. Oh, yeah. Sorry for my voice, I lost my voice here, but, no, but I started it's to back. be... You know, it's back, it's back.
It is an honor. Thank you. Just, just to know you is a great honor to me. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. My pleasure. Cinemix videos with Kucha. Thank you. Thank you.